with my Veda sticks, um, what we did is it just something that I, I can't believe someone else never did, which was why didn't somebody who liked grabbing the stick from this side because they wanted the heavier end right. for a, a louder sound, why didn't anybody think of just making this end heavier? Like this <laughs> is the thicker and heavier part yeah. with the tip. Yeah. And I, nobody did it. The, uh, we have a found or I found or whatever. Yeah. So that's what the Wicked Piston is all about. And what's so cool about it is I have had I have had sticks handed to me where I will keep changing hands like this. Because I'm like, oh no, the right one's a little heavier than the left. Oh, okay. Then I'll go, well, the right one's still heavier. I'm like, what in the heck? <laughs> <laughs> you know? So it's like, I'm over my life, over, over the years, like trying to pick them in a store when I'm a kid, and you know, you're rolling them on the, the, you know, the glass, you're rolling them on the glass thing, you know? Whee! And it's like, oh, that's wobbly. Like, oh, that's lighter, that's heavier. And you go through all these sticks, like, what does the store do with all these leftover sticks? And it turns out, like, my, my, Perception is what's off sometimes, and I have been, um, you know, I've been messed with on purpose by different, you know, s stick makers, and they're like, oh, here, pick these up. Okay. You know, I'm like, give me the heavy ones, okay? Yeah. Like, oh yeah, yeah. Uh, oh yeah. By the way, Mike, those are lighter. What? <laughs> <laughs> you know, like, absolute truth. Yeah. Absolute truth. This is over the years, you know, right. and I think that's great. I think that's fantastic. You know, like it's you. Yeah. So I'll pick up the stick. But anyway, with the Wicked Piston, because because of that weight difference, uh, if I shift, if my right is feeling heavier, I just shift it back by a couple of centimeters, and then it feels light. I shift it up, and then it feels lighter. Yeah. If I want to go faster, I just move the fulcrum a little bit. They're, they, they, they're like adaptable sticks, and they don't break. And if I grab them down here, they, they hit the drum with such impact that for the music I play, I'm asked to play loudly, I'm asked to play fast, mm -hmm. I need each each hit to be very strong. The Remo and all of them, they just, they keep, I'm proud to work with them all and have great relationships and they, they are adaptable and they change and they improve and they ask me to test things all the time. Mm -hmm. um, test on a new P77, which is an extra thick snare drum head for the durability. And um, I mean, I don't change my drum heads anymore all the time. I don't have my tech do it. First of all, he'd hate me because there's so much. <laughs> but secondly, they don't need it. And some drum heads settle better after you know so many hours of, of use, and then other ones get flat. It depends. But theirs hold up. They've been working on it. They're working unbelievably well for me. Mm -hmm. And yeah, the, every time they make it more durable, they make it more durable. Even selling the Wicked Pistons, it's like, well, are we selling more? It's like, well, no, we sell them and then they don't break. So the person doesn't buy another fan. <laughs> <laughs>